by you. I'm wearing a ring from a French company, and I like to wear a really big, spectacular ring on my left hand that's going to show on my partner's back. I try not to wear a bracelet on that hand because especially a wonderful vintage one like this can catch on his shirt. So I'll wear that on my right hand and it can hang low and look really wonderful there. Today's fashion tip for guys is that you can untuck your shirt so long as your shirt is straight across the bottom. You don't want to wear untucked a shirt that does this, but if you get a shirt that's straight, it can look very elegant and well-dressed untucked. Today's exercise is for the oblique muscles, which are responsible for every case of pivot and every mark for a lateral projection. That means side steps, bochos, morenete vinial, and giros. We want to make sure we use the correct muscles in this case and not yank with our shoulders or yank with our legs because those ways of marking pivots and lateral projections destabilize us. I'm going to take off my bracelet now because we're going to put our hands in this position. And the purpose of this is to remind us not to move the shoulders more than the rest of the body. We're going to turn the entire spine 45 degrees. Now, 45 is important because if I try to go 90 degrees, you see that I'm putting strain on my knee. And we don't want to do that. So squeeze the oblique muscles very hard and go to 45 degrees. Hold it and come back. The other direction and come back. The other direction. When we mark, we need to use the obliques, and we also add to the clarity of that with a little bit of our abduction, which is done with the supra spinatus. So just start only by abducting the arm, and then combine the rotation with the arm abduction. And now, leaving the other arm still in space. 